God's advice today. God is sending many signs, but it seems like you are ignoring all of them. So please do not ignore this video, as it is a message from God's heart to bless your life today. Before we continue, please leave your like so that more people can be reached by this message, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell to receive more videos like this. Don't ignore this video and stay until the end. I invite you to click on the first comment, where you will find a special prayer and the second best manifestation offer in the world. God said, Dear son, beloved daughter, developing a mindset of authority is fundamental for living the victorious life I have designed for you. As it is written in Romans chapter 8, verse 37, but in all these things, we are more than conquerors through him who loved us. This truth should be the foundation of your identity. The way you perceive yourself and the position you occupy in this world shapes your mindset of authority. Remember that you are not a victim of circumstances but a ruler over them. I created you to exercise dominion over your life, your emotions, and the situations that surround you. It is common for many to build their sense of authority solely on their achievements and accomplishments in the earthly realm. However, these successes, while valuable, are limited and temporary. As my son or daughter, your true authority does not come from these achievements but from your identity in me, the creator of the universe. You are an heir of my kingdom, and this grants you a unique and privileged position. Comment, Lord, I embrace your eternal love and presence in every moment of my life. When you recognize your true identity in Christ, you begin to understand that you are called to a purpose far greater than just living for yourself. In Ephesians chapter 2, verse 10, I declared, For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepared beforehand that we should walk in them. As you reflect on this passage, realize that your good works are not mere actions of merit, but rather a response to the authority you have already received. I have empowered you to be my ambassador on earth, and this implies acting in accordance with the nature and principles of my kingdom. As you deepen your relationship with me, allowing the Holy Spirit to guide your steps, you begin to understand the true reach of the authority that has been bestowed upon you. This authority is not for your personal benefit but to expand my kingdom, bringing light to the darkness and hope to troubled hearts. Comment, I believe in the victory that God has prepared for me. It is essential that you remember that your authority is not a personal achievement but a gift I have given you by my grace. When you surrender to me, you receive not only a new identity but also the strength to overcome the challenges that life presents. In John chapter 1, verse 12, it is written, But to all who received him, he gave the right to become children of God. This means that you have the capacity to represent my interests on earth. Your intimate connection with me is what strengthens you and enables you to act in my name. As you embrace this identity, you must also recognize the responsibility that comes with it. It is not just about enjoying authority but using it to manifest my love and power in every action and decision you make. I am always by your side, ready to guide you in every step of your journey. Comment, I hope with faith in God's work. As you comprehend this truth, your perspective will completely change. What once seemed a burden now becomes an opportunity for growth and transformation. You are not defined by your mistakes, limitations, or failures. As it is written in 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17, Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation, the old has passed away, behold, the new has come. This new identity in me allows you to see yourself differently, aligning your thoughts with mine. 
As you dedicate yourself to studying my word and praying, you begin to realize the power you have to change not only your life but also the lives of those around you. The transformation of the mind is a continuous process, but as you allow yourself to be renewed by me, your view of the world and of yourself will be increasingly illuminated by the truth of my love. The importance of spending time in my presence cannot be underestimated. It is in this sacred space that you can hear my voice and understand my purpose for your life. I have called you to be more than a mere spectator. You were created to be part of my eternal plan. In Matthew chapter 28, verses 19 and 20, I commissioned you, Go therefore and make disciples of all nations. And behold, I am with you always, to the end of the age. This is your mission, dear son, dear daughter. As you move in authority, remember that you are not alone. I am with you every step of the way, equipping you with everything you need to fulfill the calling I have placed in your heart. Each day is a new opportunity to demonstrate my love and grace to those around you. As you deepen your understanding of your identity in me, it is essential that you activate this authority in your daily life. Your authority as my son or daughter is not an exemption from difficulties but an invitation to face them with confidence. Did you know there is a powerful method to manifest money? This technique can transform your beliefs about reality at the deepest level of the subconscious mind and has literally changed my life. We would like to invite you to experience this incredible technique. We believe that when you trust that God wants to manifest in your life, you gain the courage to ask Him directly. God desires to bless each of us in unique and wonderful ways. Therefore, be open and confident as you seek His blessings and divine guidance, believing that He has a special plan for you. To support our channel and the team that works hard to bring this valuable content, we ask that you consider purchasing our product. Just click the link in the first comment to see how this technique can work for you too. Your purchase will not only help you manifest the life you desire but will also allow us to continue sharing inspiring and transformative messages with more people. We appreciate your support and trust. When challenges arise, remember what is written in Philippians chapter 4 verse 13, I can do all things through him who strengthens me. No matter how big or small the obstacles you encounter, I am by your side, ready to help you overcome them. Use the authority you have received to declare my truth over your life and the situations around you. As you speak and act in faith, you will see my power manifest in extraordinary ways. Do not underestimate your ability to impact the world around you. Every act of love, every word of encouragement, is a way to expand my kingdom on earth. Always remember that the authority you possess is a direct reflection of who I am and what I desire to accomplish through you. Do not be swayed by voices that try to undermine your identity or make you feel powerless. You are my beloved, and I have chosen you to do great things. As you appropriate this truth, you will begin to see your life as a journey of faith, where each day brings new opportunities to express my love and make a difference. As it is written in Psalm 139 verse 14, I praise you because I am fearfully and wonderfully made, your works are wonderful. You are a masterpiece in me, and your life is a testimony of my love and grace. Developing this mindset of authority and living accordingly is not just a matter of self-confidence but a complete surrender to me. As you yield to my purpose, your life becomes a reflection of my kingdom on earth. Always remember that, as my son or daughter, you have an eternal calling and a divine purpose. Continue seeking me, studying my word, and allowing the Holy Spirit to guide each step of your journey. I am always by your side, loving you and empowering you to live the victorious life I have planned for you. 
As we delve deeper into the truths God reveals to us, our character is increasingly shaped to His image. Every moment of reflection and meditation on the scriptures brings us closer to His truth, impacting all aspects of our daily lives. This constant connection with God is not just a habit, it is a transformative practice that leads us to experience profound internal change. When we allow ourselves to be influenced by the truths contained in God's Word, this transformation is reflected in our actions, relationships, and even in our perception of the world around us. The way we see life, the situations we face, and the people we encounter are affected by the truth we embrace. Each revelation we receive not only alters our thinking but also propels us to live with renewed purpose, aligning our lives with divine plans. With this, spiritual clarity becomes a hallmark of our journey, enabling us to discern what truly matters and motivating us to act with faith and determination. Walking in authoritative power means having the confidence and courage to boldly declare what God says about us. It is vital that we express, with conviction, truths such as, I am a child of God and I am seated with Christ in the heavenly places, or, He who is in me is greater than he who is in the world. This affirmation of identity and purpose empowers us to confront the lies of the enemy and the doubts that may arise in our minds. By recognizing the authority that has been given to us, we are called to confront and repel the lies that seek to define us. We must not allow the circumstances around us or fleeting feelings to shape who we are or determine our position in Christ. Our true identity is not based on our experiences or external perceptions, but on what God has already declared about us, and this declaration is unbreakable. To exercise this authority effectively, it is essential that we continually renew our minds and spirits through communion with God. The more we delve into His Word, the stronger our ability to discern between truth and the traps of the enemy. This firmness allows us to walk with security and stability in all areas of life, reflecting God's glory in our actions and daily choices. Finally, it is crucial to remember that exercising spiritual authority also requires humility. The power bestowed upon us should not be used selfishly or with pride, instead, it should be an instrument for advancing the kingdom of God. Our actions are not based on our own strength but on the authority that Christ has delegated to us. He is the head, and we are the body that manifests His will and power in the world. Therefore, we must submit daily to His Lordship, always seeking to align our lives with divine purposes. True spiritual authority should not be seen as a trophy that enhances our ego but as a responsibility that calls us to act with integrity and love. With love, God. I hope this message has been an inspiration to you. If you liked it, please write Amen and share this message with someone who also needs to hear it. I invite you to click on the first comment where you will find a special prayer and the second best manifestation offer in the world. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more inspiring content like this. See you tomorrow.